God. Dramatized it. <laughs> 
<laughs> While it is not entirely factual, it does give me an opportunity to say everyone's name and a little bit about them. So I beg your indulgence, nerds, and I humbly ask that you imagine it happened just like this. Who shall we invite to participate in Seattle's show, I asked one afternoon while admiring my huge pectoral muscles from the back. <laughs> <laughs> How about Molly Lewis, Paul said. <laughs> the world famous ukulele player, I said. Indeed. We will also invite Loading Ready Run, said Storm. who drive a desert bus for hope every December and raise tens of thousands of dollars for the child's play charity, I said. <laughs> Is there another loading ready run, Paul said, as Superman landed on my yacht and delivered the pizza I'd sent Aquaman to order an hour earlier? Yeah. Uh, Paul, I said, Superman is here. Do you need anything? Tell Superman to take an invitation to drummer and bearded human being Jason Finn, best known for his role with the presidents of the United States of America. <laughs> All of the presidents, I said? He must be 250 years old. <laughs> I actually mean the popular band, Will Wheaton. Oh! Will he bring us millions of peaches? <laughs> and invent a modified tacky on Pulse into a subspace anomaly. <laughs> oh, I see what you did there. <laughs> Quick, Superman, deliver this invitation to Jason Finn and stay out of that bar on the roof of the Empire State Building. I hear you're a real asshole in a truck. <laughs> Will Wheaton, Paul of Paul and Storm said. Yes, Paul of Paul and Storm. When you recount this conversation to introduce the show, make sure it doesn't run too long. <laughs> In that case, I said, we should also invite internet guy and nerd songster Hank Green. <laughs> we should invite my good friend, Xbox Live Stephen Toulouse, wielder of the band hammer, Stepto. <laughs> and then finally, we should invite renowned puzzlesmiths James Ernest and Mike Selliker. Take a breath, we shouted, done and done! <laughs> and just like that, my friends, Woodstock 2.0 was assembled to provide you with three magnificent hours of geeks and music. I invite you now to silence your cell phones, lull your cats, and play. <laughs>